good question. It's a good question. It's really hard to say. You know, I, just, I just think that being someone who's been in the metal all my life and just, you know, uh, just music in general is hard. Uh, and um, I think it's the maybe the anger and the rage you have in me that just, it still comes out. Uh, Definitely, yeah. It's because I think, you know, even both of us working, it's, you know, the, uh, anything could be the traffic, could be yeah. inspiration because the traffic sucks in LA. <laughs> could be, uh, you know, maybe you just had a rough week or something just aggravating. You can take your negative, you know, taking our, our negative energy and just fo focusing it. It's, you know, it's what we love to do and making it positive, you know. And jamming yeah. with different guys, too, is definitely inspiration. And we definitely push each other, you know, as far as musically and stuff like that. Yeah, yeah definitely. I've been one of the lucky guys who've been able to jam with some of the best drummers in the world. You know, through Tim Williams, Gene Hogan, Tim Young, Nick Parker, John Sankey, of course, I got to throw Raymond Herrera in there. I've jammed with some of the best guys. Yeah, me too with guitar players. You know, I've got yeah. a lot of the great players. A lot of my favorite ones too, which is, which is kick ass. So, that definitely. Uh, yeah. But sitting in the room, like, you know, we would do it all fast. Like, you know, I think that helped a lot too. Like, just sitting at it four hours, just, we got, I got this, oh, I got this, you know, we just kind of, kind of vibe off of one another, the energy. And that, um, that's really good. It seems like a lot of people in a lot of bigger bands, a lot of newer bands don't really write like that anymore. A lot of it's, you know, it's, it's lost that organic feel. Yeah, computer, 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 send it to each other, files. Just let the creative energy. Yeah, well, it's, much more, yeah, it's much more organic. Joe Payne here. Oh, Hi. <laughs> nice shorts, buddy. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Pale, pale look at legs. legs. Walmart, look at these legs, yeah, man. Pale, pasty, <laughs> legs. That's how we get all the ladies. <laughs> <laughs> it is. It I works. Know, it's all, all of us, you know, in the room jamming and stuff, just we feed off each other. That kind of thing is pretty inspirational. Definitely. Well, um, I do know that you guys made it on the Billboard Top 200. Mm -hmm. How does that feel? Um, it feels great, you know, it's like, I've been there before. Yeah, 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 yeah. I've been there before, but it's cool to be there with this band. It's cool, definitely. It's a really good feeling. Feels like, uh, feels like I've accomplished something. <laughs> I've done something. <laughs> yeah. That's it? No other question? You want to ask us how the food is?
fun question to ask you. I noticed your artwork is very unique and interesting. How does that come, come evolve and stuff? Who um, does your artwork? That's what I want to know. What was the guy's name that did our artwork? I have no clue. <laughs> You know, I can't remember off the top of my head who. Guys, what, what do you think I feel of your artwork? Not really um, basically, basically, uh, our message in Bringer Plagues is, uh, you know, it can be taken biblically. It can be taken, you know, in, in that way. Basically, when we set when we set out and we named the record that, basically, the the way we looked at it was, this is a new band. It's the same band, obviously, but it's a new band. It's it's been reborn in a way. And our music, it's like, you know, we're unleashing a new play upon the world. That's that's the way we look at it, you know. It's, it's not like a biblical thing to us. It's like, you know, this is divine heresy and we're just, just getting it out there, you know. So people are just like, when they pop it in, they're just like, holy shit, you know, this is what we want to hear. And, we, and, and not take that CD out, you know. So that's, that's what it resembles to us, the, you know, the locusts and stuff like that. You know, it all comes with... The locusts being the in any in any sense of any kind of plagues, you know, whether it's biblical, whether it's you know a comical movie, whatever. The locusts seem to be the main thing that you see when you know in, in movies and stuff. It's always the locusts. So you know, definitely we, we took a lot of influence from that. The reapers with the decaying hands, you know, the the uh, the plagues of you know the the uh, like the old French plagues where you know they decay. You know what I mean? You know, talking about like, yeah, you know, bubonic plague and stuff like that. So we, you know, it's it's this is our plague. You know, this is divine heresy's plague, and we're unleashing it upon the globe. And hopefully, people will uh, will keep keep enjoying it the way they are, and expect more from us in the future. And do you have anything else to ask? Oh, yeah, I have a question. Um, do you think that with the with the Moon Spell tour that you'll you'll gain some new fans? I mean, what's your what's your goal with this tour? Um, absolutely, absolutely. Uh, you, you, you know, me coming from a lot of my influences, a lot of Euro European metal bands and stuff like that. Like I've been listening to Moonspell for years. Uh, so it, to me, it's it's cool because you know there's a lot of people that probably wouldn't listen to Divine Heresy or bands in our genre that are coming out that you know, and, and we have had people you know that are in front of the stage and they're just like this. You know, and, and but by the end of the show, they're bobbing their head and they're into it. You know, and you know they're they're leaving and telling their friends, "Wow, you know, I saw this band." So, I definitely think it's a good. Uh, it'll help us better. You know, Wait, open up to up. open up to more people and and hopefully um, hopefully too and change. You know, since th those bands are bigger in Europe than they are here, you know, it'll help us get you know Definitely. our our foot in the door better in Europe as well. I guess that's pretty much it. Thank okay. you for um, taking time out to that's talk nice to you. us. No Thank problem. You much. And um, again, we're from Bizarre Entertainment, and have have fun tonight. <laughs>